Hey guys, Ninth Street Auto Plaza, located in Mount Carmel, Illinois. Today we got a 2011 Toyota 4Runner for sale. This is the Trail Edition, four-wheel drive. Uh, 119,000 miles on this thing. It's got the 4.0 liter V6. It does have a clean Carfax. Really sharp uh, Trail Edition. We're going to start with the front end of this thing. We take you on a virtual tour, show you the imperfections of the vehicle, and we are going to point them out. We don't waste your time or ours. So we're going to start with the bottom end here. Uh, minor little rock chips across the bottom. Of course, this is all plastic, so it's not going to matter anything. Minor little ones here, very minor. Up here on the hood, looks like somebody has tried to knock them in, I guess, uh, put a paint pan on it. Uh, there is some up here across the front. Uh, it would be nice to put a, a wind guard up here, cover that uh, those up. Uh, we're going to go down the driver's side here first. Um, paint's really good condition, real high luster and shine. Uh, we don't hear this tire. Um, these should be MTs. They're Cooper, uh, yeah, they're um, Evolution MT Coopers. They're uh, 265 70R 17s. There's your tread. Front fender's in good condition. Uh, right back here, we do have little bitty rock chips, very minor, on the driver's door. Maybe a little bitty scratch right here. Passenger drawers in good condition. Rear quarter, a little scratch right there. Of course, you do have your rack across the top here. Uh, back tires, they are cupped a little bit. Of course, these are MTs, so they are cupped a little bit in here. I don't know if you can see it. Not too bad. Front ones are not, the back ones are a little bit. There is a little bit of a rash in here, pitting. Very minor though. Coming around the back of this thing. Tailgate's in good condition except for right here. Somebody has been lifting this thing up and obviously in their garage has been uh, hitting something. So it's a little bit of nicks here and there. Just right in this area from here to here. You do you have your uh, towing. We work our way up the passenger side. Looks like we do have a little scratch up here on the rear balance. Again, there's your... Uh, Rough system. Rear quarter seems to be in good condition. It's just a little bit of debris. Uh, passenger rear door, minor little rock chip there. Like I said, guys, I'm pointing everything out that I can see. I'm not gonna, like I said, we're not wasting your time on these things. It's just lint. Front fender's in good condition. It's minimal pitting here. Not actually not all that bad, honestly. Um, I forgot to show you this rear tire. And there is some cupping going on in here. Again, they're uh, Cooper MTs. All right, let's go to the inside and check the inside out. We do have a power seat. We'll check the functions and all electronics of the vehicle. Everything works as it should there. We do have books in this 4Runner. Dash is intact. We do have a moonroof. We'll, when we start the vehicle up, we'll show you that. Door's in good shape. Tears in good shape. Put your drink holders. All this folds down. Uh, looks like you got your Husky uh, liners in this thing too. Move on to the rear hatch. I do love these things. Uh, you just click this button. It's got uh, one slide here. You can go all the way out to here. Um, it's really nice getting your luggage out. There's a little storage area up there. Um, nice and clean back here. You got your uh, 400 watt AC unit here. And a 12 volt here. Nice sliding unit. I like those things.
Again, guys, good interior, no rips or tears. Do have power seat on the side too. All functions do operate as they should. Okay, we're gonna get in and start it up. Okay, right now we got 119.019. That's 119.019 on the miles. No check engine lights or anything like that, that on at the time. We do have this uh, seatbelt light, which I do not have my seatbelt on currently. Uh, we'll do a rev test real quick for you. Good throttle response. Put you up on the hood so you can hear it. Okay, we'll start with uh, this side first. We'll show you everything does work. Here's your mirrors. Driver's side's good to go. Passenger side's good to go. We'll go ahead and set off. Uh, see, these are all auto. Make sure it all, all work. It's auto down. And auto up. All those function as they should. Um, right down here, we have your, I don't know if you guys can see it, that's your 400 watt, uh, it's your 100 watt down here. You can turn it to 400 watt if you want. Um, rear windshield wiper back here, uh, mirrors, and this is your interior lighting. Um, we'll come down and work our way down the center stack here. Um, you know, we're gonna go ahead and check the fan modes. Show you that each one of these do work. And I'm listening for it, so uh, this thing does have really cold AC too. Extremely cold. Okay, let's uh, check out the radio. Sounds good. Got a lot of bass to it too. Really good uh, sound radio. Um, Self explanatory stuff down here your AC, etc. Temperature over here. Um, Let's see where are we gonna go from here. Let's see your steering wheel. I'll go ahead and show you that does work. Change your stations here and here. Uh, your cruise control down here it does work as it should. Um, put this thing in four high. Okay, four high is engaged. Back to four, two, two wheel drive. Uh, we got your rear. Uh, this is your rear glass. I'll show you it does work. That is an auto function all up and down. Rear glass does work as it should. We'll move up here to the center stack on top. Uh, your slide button, here's your... There's your roof rack. These things are sturdy. You can, pretty, you can put a ton of weight on these things. So guys, I'm not honestly sure about all this. Obviously the um, uh, four wheel drive system, you can turn this thing and uh, it's kind of like the the Land Rovers. Um, uh, you should have rock climbing in here, sand, etc., just like the Land Rovers do. Speed of the, I'm not sure exactly what this is. I'm sure you guys that are looking at these will know more than I do. It's set on medium. Um, obviously sets up to the four wheel drive system. Um, let's see. This thing drives out really nice. Uh, it does have the MT tires on it, so you know you are going to get a little of the, you know, the vibration from the tires. Um, if you're going to drive it through the city and everything like that, I'd probably put some ATs back on it. But uh, it does look good with the MTs on it, though. Uh, I'm trying to think of anything else I may be missing here. You got your uh, AC outlet down here, needed. Uh, charger, cell phone, etc. Uh, you got an auxiliary down here, 12 volt to your radio. I don't have any CDs in there. Okay, what else am I missing here, guys? I'm trying to, like I said, I try to push everything electronic in these vehicles. Um, I'm gonna do the door locks. They do work, though. Uh, okay. 
I think we'll make our way to the engine and show you it. It's your 4.0 liter. Very clean under here. You have a Toyota battery. Very quiet. Like I said, the guys, this thing runs out great. No issues at all. I do believe um, we have a limited uh, Forerunner sitting right there, actually. Um, from driving both of them, I do believe the Trail Edition does have lower gear ratio because it seems like it does have more, a little bit more get up and go than limited on a tower on a takeoff. Um, other than that, guys, this thing drives out really nice. Uh, like I said, ice cold AC. Um, everything works on it. Um, really good looking truck. So let's do a little recap on this thing. We got a 2011 Toyota 4Runner. It is a trail edition, four wheel drive, 119,000 miles. We got the 4.0 V6, clean Carfax on this thing. Hey guys, we're located at 800 West 9th Street in Mount Carmel, Illinois. Come take a test drive on this thing. I think you really like it. You can see this video in the Carfax. I always suggest people check out the Carfaxes. Uh, you can see that on our website. That's 9thstreetautoplaza.com. Again, 9thstreetautoplaza.com. Hey guys, I hope this helped your uh, buying experience, and uh, if you want, give us a call at 618-450-2600. That's 618-450-2600. Um, you guys have a good day, and I uh, hope you come and uh, take a test drive.